big hello to all my friends from tiny tot tales we all love dogs don't we well kipper is such an adorable dog that we can't help falling in love with him let's find out together what kipper is up to in this fun book let's go kipper was in a mood for tidying his basket you're falling apart he said to his rabbit you are chewed up and you are soggy he said to his ball and his bone and you are disgusting he said to his smelly old blanket out they went ah <sighs> that's better said kipper but it was not better now his basket was uncomfortable he twisted and he turned he wiggled and he wriggled but it was no good he couldn't get comfortable silly basket said kipper and went outside outside there were two ducks they looked very comfortable standing on one leg hmm that's what i should do said kipper but he wasn't very good he could only wobble some wrens had made a nest inside a flower pot it looked very cozy Hmm, I should sleep in one of those," said Kipper. But Kipper would not fit inside a flower pot. He was much too big. The squirrels had made their nest out of sticks. Hmm, I will build myself a stick nest," said Kipper. But Kipper's nest was not very good. He could only find three sticks. The sheep looked very happy just sitting in the grass. No, that was no good either. The grass was much too tickly. The frog had found a sunny place in the middle of the pond. He was sitting on a lily pad. I wonder if I could do that," said Kipper. But he couldn't. Perhaps a nice dark hole would be good. thought kipper the rabbit seemed to like them but it was not a rabbit hole kipper rushed indoors and hid underneath his blanket his lovely old smelly blanket kipper put the blanket back in his basket he found his rabbit sorry rabbit he said He found his bone and his ball. I like my basket just the way it is," yawned Kipper. He climbed in and pulled the blanket over his head. It's the best basket in the whole wide. Shh. Aww. We all have our favorite pillow and blanket that we can't get rid of even when they are old and tattered. Actually, me too. Well, that's all from Tiny Dot Tales. Till next time everyone. Doodles. If you enjoyed listening to this story, please like and subscribe to Tiny Dot Tales. Meanwhile, keep watching, learning and having fun.